My wife and I have four kids, so we're well aware of what goof off can do. Okay. So my mm -hmm. son and I will show Hi, you. Hi, people. Dad should do something really important. So, what's that? Say hi. Hi, friend. Next week, we'll see just how well Goof Off does with enamel, spray paint, and Sharpie markers. It's been a week since I painted the board, and now I'm getting ready to try and remove it. I've got my paper towels, my bottle of Goof Off, my protective gloves, and the plastic scraper. My son's going to be the cameraman while I try to remove the enamel, the spray paint, and the Sharpies. So watch out, Preston's a little shaky with his camera. But this is kind of cool, as opposed to some older goof off that was all liquid, it's more of a gel form, so it's easier to keep track of. After a few seconds of the goof off being on the Sharpie marker, it started coming right off really easily. Okay, now we can do this one. Oh, you, wanna, you wanna get me? Okay, tell me three, two, one, action. It is one. Oh, okay. Now, I originally put the enamel on pretty thick, so it was a little bit harder to get off. But as you can see, it does come off. It just does take a little more work. Okay, last one. I can't do this. It's hard. Really hard. Okay, so now we're going to use the paint scraper. Look at that. It's coming right off. For the last one. The spray paint went on pretty thick because Preston was having a lot of fun with it. So we took a second round of goof off. So I applied more, gave it a couple of minutes, and then I started to wipe it off again. All right, now we're gonna take a clean cloth and we're gonna wipe off the whole board. I'm doing it. Well, you don't have gloves on, Preston, so you mm -hmm. can't do this one. All right, now we wiped off all the residue from the board. And as you can see, all of the enamel, the spray paint, and the Sharpie marker is gone. Goodbye.